What's up everybody? My name is White Dragons and welcome back to the show. So today we're going to be looking at a couple of things and this will be a real quick one and then I'll probably tie it in with something else. But we're over here in the wet bi wetlands biomes. And as you can see these are really tall trees. Actually particularly I'm, I want to know what this is. This is called willow wood. I guess because it grows that. I'm not really interested in that though. What I'm interested in is not only gathering seeds but also gathering wood today. So, uh, how are we gonna do that? Well, there's a simple little trick to it that's pretty amazing. Uh, and a lot of people, I've noticed, go, let me get these seeds real quick, sorry. Kind of important here. <laughs> I gotta have the seeds, you know? Gotta grow. Uh, like my, uh, like my series with Better Than Wolves. Really, seriously. It's like a freaking Monday and they're doing this. Good God. You're happy. I'm happy for it. You know what? I'm happy that the birds are happy. I am ecstatic that the birds are able to sing and and do so much. Yes. All right. So, see how tall this tree is? There's no way you could actually break it down from here. But if you take a if you take your dirt, what the fuck? Okay. You take your dirt blocks, okay? And this is only with Attack of the Bee Team, and I think there's a mod that does this. And, uh, let's just say, uh, you know, you pick this one. You know, let's get rid of this. Knock this down a little bit so we don't lose all our dirt. Okay. Now, if you start at the top here and work your way down, you'll see a nifty little thing. I think I just showed you when we broke that top block up top, but I'll show you down here. So, um, a lot of times I've seen a lot of people just, like, leave like three or four pieces of wood up top and that's a real pain in the butt to me because that's kind of like being wasteful and everybody that's pretty much watched any of my episodes or any of my let's plays knows I don't like wasting product or material or whatever you want to call it but see it automatically decomposes as you go down so you're basically going to be able to pick up everything and not have to worry about anything so we got what we got eight sa I got some moss, and I have no idea how... I think I got it from doing that little trick right there. Uh, which is breaking... Blocking up and then breaking down. It's a common little trick. A lot of people don't use. And I don't know why. Where was this at? I'm going to put it right there. I always like to replant. I don't I don't screw around with that, folks. Um, you know, I broke that one. There was a couple more that grew. And I'm not looking for the willow wood right now. The willow wood is not something I'm interested in. I'm only interested in the spruce wood, which looks like I'm not going to have any more. To Wait, is, there, is this spruce wood or is this willow wood? This is spruce wood. Okay, so wow, it's really high up there. Um, let's see, 19 blocks may not do it. But we'll find out. We'll find out here. All right, so if we go right here but you know early stages if you don't have an axe and I have not been back to the house yet uh, after the last episode I, I got a, I had to go do something so I kind of had to stop oh, I had to stop doing what I, the, uh, the LP here and uh, go take care of some RL business and um, whatnot so I'm gonna have to probably stop and wow look at that mountain that's a freaky looking mountain All right, but uh, yeah. So like first dayers, when you're having issues, I mean, you could actually use this for a barricaded area. Is it getting night? No. Okay. It's this dirt. Where's the hell's the dirt at? Is it on the other side? Should be. I, well, what the hell? Oh, there it is. Okay. All right. I know. There's tons of dirt. Why? What the hell? But dirt's important. It's important. Keeps me clean. But, uh, yeah. But, you know, first dayers who are having, you know, troubles getting stone or something, just go get a, go find the biggest tree and block your way up there. Then break the blocks as far as down as you can. And boom. You're, you're going to be fine. You're going to be safe. For the night, of course. It's also a good way of doing, um, the, uh, tree houses as well. Uh, which I thought about doing a treehouse for this LP, but I was like, nah, a lot of people use... Oh! That's a bad idea. 
more iron there. Mud's used for something. I can't remember what, what that's used for. But it's used for something. What the fuck? Okay. Okay. Is this a half block system? Okay, hold on. Hold on. I got this. Boom. Ha! Ah. Can't hold me down. Oh, no. Why is that not broken? See, that's gonna bug me. It's gonna bug me a lot. Where's it at? Right there? Yeah, it's right where the tree was. Why didn't it break down? Oh, it's one block. Ah. Anyways. Oh, well. Say la vie. But doing it like th doing it like this will save you a lot of time on your axe, a lot of time getting and dealing with getting an axe. I'm actually interested to see what this how this willow breaks down. But what the fuck? Okay. I don't know what the hell that was for. Oh, that's the other thing. Wetlands has a different lighting effect. That's pretty weird. Wait, is that another one? Where's the sun at? The sun is setting. We need to go. So, all right. So I'm gonna run back, get up, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, we're back, and we are just now back from the uh, wonderful little walk here. Uh, I'm trying to cut the videos short by a little bit to uh, give us more time for different things. So we got 33 spruce wood out of that. Um, uh, 12 saplings, which is not bad. I've already planted some oak out there, so we'll see how that works out. And um, let's get a chest made real quick. So we've got something to work with here. We can dump all our material, or not our materials, but all of our uh, seedlings in. Um, I have not made a garden yet because I haven't had the tools. So we're going to do that probably next. And put our gardening stuff here. So. Mandrake seeds, strawberry seeds, water artichokes. I think that needs to go like that. That's flowers. I'm not really interested in dealing with that. Um, cotton seeds we're actually going to put down here. Turnip seeds. All right. Uh, more flowers. Tomato seeds. Sweet. And regular Minecraft seeds, which is very important for catching animals and whatnot. Barley seed. Important. Uh, I think this is part of the witchery I think that's what I need you know what to be honest with you this is what we probably need to do is put our different try to put our different flowers and stuff together but try to put them in like the same um, the same mods almost like rice we know needs to go with food obviously coffee beans of course uh, da -da 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 -da. and that's about it okay so let's do another one and for this one we're gonna put our we're actually just gonna make one actually probably be better um, let's put this one right here and we'll put all our books in it all the really important stuff we're gonna put half our torches in um, and we'll put the food I like laying my food out like this so that I can just easily like left click or shift and and uh right click or yeah shift and left click and it'll go in right off the bat so like like you do it like this and then you just shift and then it'll fill it up for you. Same thing with the coal. See? Easy as cake. I didn't know if you knew that. You know, just in case you didn't. Sand, wood, spruce wood, split that up. Okay, and that leaves us with uh, some cobblestone and some dirt. Got some more spruce wood there we need to get rid of. All right, and food. This is raw meat. This is used for uh, the whatchamacallit. And I'm actually going to put the zombie meat in here because I consider zombie meat at early stage food. Uh, I know that sounds weird, but it's the honest truth. All right, so there's the skeleton over there. Not a lot of creepers. I lied. I lied big time. Look at this. Well, they don't see me, so it's pretty obvious. Which is pretty nice. They don't see me. Um. So I guess we should get some tools, maybe, going here. Let's see. 
I'm gonna get rid of this one oak. If I can. No, I want it up here. There we go. Alright, so the first thing we're gonna need to make, of course, is our pickaxe. Our pickaxe is the most important thing in our in our combination here. And next thing we're gonna need to make is hoe, because that's gonna be the next thing we're gonna need to do uh, later on. So that's kind of important. Uh, I need more wood. That's what I was going in this one for. One, two, three, four. That'll give us uh, eight. No, it gives us sixteen. No, god dang it. It gives us eight. All right, then an axe. Boom. Carry on us as backups. We need two more pickaxes, and you'll see why in just a second. Because that ravine over there is calling my name. And we'll do two swords. Because swords go out pretty damn fast in the beginning. Alright, so if we type in Tinker, we should get the Tinker's Construct stuff. That's thermal expansion. Let's see. Tinker's. Nope. It says Tinker. Oh, Tinker's. S apostrophe. There we go. Uh, now, I want my crafting table. It's a stencil table. I don't want the stenciling table. I want the cur the tool station? No. Not tool station. Is it tool station? I can't remember. No, because you need... Yeah. Is it? I don't remember. I guess we do have to go with the stencil first. The hell is this? Tool forger. No, tool forger comes later on. So, it's this one. So, how do I make a... Oh. What? Seriously? You have to have... Do you use an iron helmet to make a stencil? And I'll be right back. Well, that was an interesting conversation right there. But anyways, let's get back to what we were doing. So we need to make a stencil. And the way you make the stencil is with two planks and two sticks. Which is... Okie dokie, we got that. So Tinker's Construct. I love... I like Tinker's Construct. Um... That's gonna give us four, right? Yeah. I I really do like Tinker's Construct because it does make it a little bit more challenging for you, but it also gives you that that extra little freedom to do things. It was like this, right? Like this. Yeah. It gives us two actually. I need to do two more. Um. So. Like I said, I, I really do like it. I, I really like Tinker's Construct. I wish a lot of people would get more into the Tinker's Construct. And I really wish Minecraft would do the same thing. Because uh, I've seen a lot of different, uh, what they call, quote-unquote, uh, Minecraft clones come up. And they work, they do a pretty good job. So, let me think here. I need, I need four pieces of that. That should give me my crafting table which you're wondering why am I getting two crafting tables well you'll see in just a second so you need this and then you need one of these tool station what the hell a crafting station I don't need a stencil tool station crafting station I wonder, what the hell what the hell is this this is I don't remember this Okay. Uh, maybe, maybe I do remember it. Maybe I'm just being stupid. Ooh, and there's a bunch of enemies out there. I'm lying. Ooh. Okay. All right. So now we need our stencil table, which is this one. No, tool station. Yay! We upgraded. All right. So that should give us. Okay. Yeah, that's right. All right. So there's a crafting bench. Tinker's table. That's pretty awesome. So, like, uh, for example, if I want to make another um, furnace, I could if I wanted to. Um, you can't. S Let me see. Hit O. Yeah. There you go. Uh, the main way to repair or change your tools: place a tool and material on the left and get started. So that's pretty nifty. Kind of want all these bastards to die, so we can get their bones, maybe. Except there aren't any bones. There's a bone down there. I got my dirt right, yeah. What if we can take out that creeper? Oh, he's coming anyways. Hey, thanks for coming, buddy. Appreciate it. 
I appreciate you. Whoop, where are you going? Come here. Oh crap, that's right. I didn't kill a creeper yet. So now I'm a creeper. So cool! Alright, creeper putting down dirt. How awesome. Alright. Probably gonna need to make some room here. But I really want to go and get... No, we're not. We're gonna wait. Actually, I tell you what we need to do. Do I have another bone? No, I don't. I've got bone. I don't need a bone. I need a stick. So we'll put the stick in here. The cool thing about the uh, about this thing is, is like, see, if I walk away, nothing falls off. It stays in there. So that's pretty damn cool. Um, I need to make a shovel because I have a sneaky suspicion we're gonna need it. And let's go ahead and put this up, because that's part of Tinker's Construct, which is right there. Materials, and I need to... Let's leave that, too. And we're going to put this up and put this in there. All right, cool. Uh, food. Do we have any food? Look at there, I'm a creeper. Uh, no, we don't have a piece of food, and our hunger's a little low. So let's leave the sword, and let's leave the stencils, just in case, because you can do, there's something else you need to do with the stencils along with it. Um, whoop. I love, I can see my little creeper hand, that's freaking awesome. So, oh, let the world generate a little bit. And I will be right back. Okay, just so that you know. Uh, no, no, don't run, where'd you go? Where'd you go? No. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, we have the bat. We have the bat. We have the bat. I can fly. I can fly. <laughs> they know not what they've given me. Anyways, I thought I'd show that. I just saw him. I was like, what's that noise? And it was a bat. <laughs> oh, yeah, here's a look. Check it out. Pretty nice, huh? Like the new condominium. We'll make this a little bit cleaner. A little bit neater. I'm trying to record. I'm trying to upload a video. From my, my computer so lags when Fraps is uh, running. Ugh. I gotta clean up my hard drive. Alright, that's all I got.